A Mercury High Court has dismissed the suit filed by Samuel Tom challenging Governor Hyson Dalia and the Commission of Inquiry into the Income and Expenditure of Benway State Government from May 29, 2015 to May 28, 2023 for being statute barred. Justice Tessa Aswa dismissed the suit while ruling on the application of extension of time filed by counsel representing Samuel Tom Oba Madwabuchi that the application was incompetent. Justice Aswa, while ruling, agreed with Council of Governor Alia, Matthew Burka, and the Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice and Public Order, Fidelis Nyim, preliminary objections that action or proceedings against public officers are regulated by the Benway State Public Officers Protection Act, and according to the Act, the action must commence within three months. In accordance with the Benway State Public Protection Act and the rule of the court, the plaintiff, which is Samuel Otom, was supposed to commence his actions immediately on the 27th of February 2024 when the Income and Expenditure Commission of Inquiry 2024 was gazetted. But Samuel Otom filed his motion on notice on the 28th of May 2024, which was clearly more than three months as speculated by the Public Officers Protection Act, and as such, the case is started barred. Put in the proper perspective, today being the 30th day of uh, July <clears throat> 2024, the Benway State High Court, uh, Court 5, presided by Justice Titi Aswa, dismissed the suit filed by the former governor of Benway State, uh, Samuel Yurari Mutom, uh, where he was challenging the the issue of investigation of uh, activities, financial activities of Benway State covered within his period. Uh, the Commission of Query was set to look into the income and expenditure of the Benway State, uh, both the state and local government, from uh, 29th of May 2015 to 28th of May 2023, covering the eight years of autonomous administration. And um, why first, what Otom did the first time when the commission was uh, um, inaugurated, he went to the air and uh, said it was a good development and uh, instructed his people that have served under him to appear before the commission and give their account. The after, I said, Esquire, in the case, I was alongside my principal, Mr. Mohammed Ndawani, and Esquire, who was the presentation was called seventh, eighth, and ninth respondents. What we witness this morning is the dismissal of the case. And before I proceed, when an order of dismissal is made, it means the case has lost its life. That case cannot be refiled in the high court of the state again. If it were to be an order of maybe striking out, there would have been an opportunity for them to refile Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.